What's up, YouTube? This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. And this is a screen test, a battle of 1080p screens. So today, guys, I'm going to show you the quality of all these 1080p screens on these devices, guys, and see which one is King Supreme. So today, guys, I have the... Um, Asus Zenfone 3 Deluxe, the new one, 1080p screen. I got the Huawei Mate 9 1080p screen. Uh, I have the OnePlus 3 1080p screen. I got the Honor 8 1080p screen. Uh, I have the Xon 7 1080p screen. Uh, and I have uh, the Lico Li Pro 3 1080p screen. But I resurrected the uh, LG V20 because I gave it a lot of slack for the poor screen. So this is going to be the only 1440p screen that I'm going to kind of throw in the mix so y'all guys can see. See if it can redeem itself against the 1080p screen. Just kind of have a little fun with this. Uh, so I'm going to put this on the side so you guys can see this. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you some uh, stuff here on all these devices and you be the judge for yourself. So get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. All right, guys, so let's go on to do one thing. Let's turn up the brightness on all these devices to full brightness uh, with all these devices. We got all devices on full brightness, as you can see. All right, so let's go ahead and open up a web page so you guys can see how bright the display is on each device. Now, let's get rid of the keyboards. Okay. All right. So when we're looking at all these devices here, um, and, and again, you be the judge for yourself. Uh, the Mate 9 looks like the brightest display so far. All right. And again, all 1080p's. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that Google G and we're gonna blow it up. All right. So let's blow up all the G's the same here on every device all right so we guys can see this on every device here all right so uh when we thinking at this all right and from my perspective here from my perspective the one plus three and the zenfone three gives you the better color uh the mate nine is completely washed out Look at that, washed out. Uh, and uh, when you're looking at, uh, even when you're looking at the, uh, the, the uh, Honor 8, uh, the G looks a little washed out. Uh, the XL7 looks pretty good. Uh, the Lico Leaf Pro 3 is completely washed out. And uh, the LG V20 right here with the 1440p screen looks okay, but it's still washed out. All right, so take a peep at that. And again, uh, the uh, Zenfone 3 looks good, and the OnePlus 3 looks good, and the Exxon 7 looks good. Uh, and uh, the LG comes in maybe a fourth, time, fourth place here, but everything else is washed out. And uh, the uh, Mate 9 looks the worst. Look at that. The Mate 9 looks the worst, guys. So take a peep at that. All right, let's go to our next test. All right. As you can see here, uh, again, when you're looking at every device at full brightness. Now, what this display test does, it forces every device to go to 50%. So, as we see every device that is 1080p except uh, the V20, uh, let's go ahead and go to uh, our tester here. I want you guys to see this. And let's look at each panel and see which one uh, gives you the better color. Now, when you're looking at this again, every device is forced by the app to go to 50% brightness, 50% brightness. Just make sure we understand that. All right, so when we're looking at all devices here, uh, looking at uh, the Zenfone 3 
red looks pretty good uh, the mate 9 red looks good all the devices red looks good except when you get to the uh, honor 8 and the Lico Lipro 3 it's a little darker red all right the Exxon 7 is a little lighter red and the V20 man it, it just it just one of those devices that just it just doesn't make the cut here but I, I wanted to put it in uh, with these devices but look at the V20 all right, now I've made a, uh, a, a test about this before and the V20 looks horrible when it comes down to the color accuracy and the color itself. All right, so let's go to the next color. All right, uh, all the greens looks pretty good on every device. Uh, again, uh, the, the V20 definitely uh, looks pretty bad here. All right, so look at that. It looks pretty good on all devices. All right, let's go to the blues. All right. All right, so when you're looking at the blues here, uh, again, you be the judge for yourself. But look at the Mate 9. It looks a little washed out when it comes down to the, the, the blue here. Uh, but all of them looks pretty deep, except when you get to Lico Lipro 3 here. Uh, it does look a little lighter, and uh, the V20 just look horrible. Uh, so when you're looking at all these devices, again, you be the judge for yourself when it comes down to the blues. All right, so let's look at the whites. All right, so when you're looking at the whites on all devices, uh, the Mate 9 looks like the, the, the whiter white here, uh, along with the OnePlus 3 uh, does look white. Now, the Zenfone 3 look a little grayish, uh, along with the Lico Lipro 3 look a little grayish, and look like the, uh, the 8, the Huawei 8 looks a little grayish, and the V20 just this completely totally different color and this is supposed to be white so you be the judge for yourself when it come down to the whites now let's get to the grays here all right uh again the mate 9 uh, grays look a little lighter here uh the zenfone 3 definitely has a good color the one plus 3 has a good color uh the, the huawei 8 here uh looks uh, more of a, a different color here more of a bluish color, uh, but all the rest of them look gray and uh, the LG V20 more look like a muddy gray. All right, so let's go to the blacks. All right, so when we go to the blacks, all of them looks pretty good in black. Uh, so we go go on to go to the yellow. All right, so when you're looking at the yellow here, again, both, all of them looks pretty good. Uh, the Lico Leap Pro 3 looks a little darker, a little muddy looking. Uh, and the V20 this terrible um, so yeah looks pretty good all I IPS displays here all right the Zenfone 3 looks a little uh, you know a little darker here all right all right so let's go to another color here we want you guys to see this all right now uh, the, I like the way the color looks on the Zenfone 3 and the color on the Mate 9 looks a little washed out look at that looks a little washed out there uh, the one plus 3 looks good uh, the honor 8 looks good need a little light all right uh, the XO 7 looks good uh, the Lico Lee Pro 3 looks a little washed out there well a little more darker uh, there all right and the LG V20 just terrible just terrible Wow all right so let's go to look at the cyan color all right so we're looking at this all devices looks pretty good again uh, i'm looking at the mate 9 it's a little brighter look a little washed out there all right uh and the xl7 looks good the one plus three looks good all of them looks good the lico Lee pro 3 ah, a little washed out a little bit and again the, the v20 looks terrible all right and that is the end of all the colors so guys i just wanted to show you uh the screen qualities of all devices here all of them at 1080p and i threw the lg v20 in just for s's and giggles uh and I just try to see if it can redeem itself but as you can see and it's i mean it is what it is the lg v20 definitely has a more dimmer more darker more unaccurate panel that i ever saw so i mean it is what it is i mean it don't lie y'all sell for y'all sell going against 1080p screen this is a 1440p screen just kind of putting it in there in all of ips so listen you be the judge for yourself when it come down to all these colors and all their glory this is eric from easy computers so just leave a question down below let me know what you think about the screen quality of all these devices. See you guys on the next video. Peace.